Absolutely, I live with fear. I never know when it's going to come back. I don't know why it comes back. The black dogs just come out of the forest when they want to and try to trap me once again. That sense of being a part of the world is lost and you experience the desolation of being nowhere and nobody. Trying to fit it into the experience of someone who's depressed is almost impossible. I know that my wife doesn't understand it and we've lived together for 40 years. How do you get a life and live a life and get through a life where you're burdened by chronic depression? Well, you settle at some point for the kind of life you can have. If you're born without a foot, you still have to walk. You still have to get somewhere. And if, you're, if you have chronic depression, you still have to stumble along and try to get through as best you can. When I first became depressed, I thought it was something that would go away. It was only very gradually that I came to the conclusion, which was a very distressing conclusion for me, that I would never, I would never be cured. And that itself was a kind of liberation, because I knew that there was no point in chasing rainbows, chasing miracle cures. What I would have to do is organize my life in such a way that I could accommodate this perennial problem. I've found a career in, in which deadlines are the issue, which I can work toward and fall apart and then pick myself up and work towards some more and finally hit the deadline. So I figured out how to do that. Uh, I've written several books, but none of them have had the longevity of In the Jaws of the Black Dogs. I still get letters about it. I, I'm grateful for this. I've been told that my book helped to interpret the experience of depression to people who don't have it, but who live with someone who does have it. And this to me has been the greatest reward. Millions of people live with chronic depression all the time. And it drains their lives and obstructs them in, in exactly the way it has, has mine. But you take the best drugs you can find, you get the best treatment you can find, you know you'll never be cured like the man without a foot. It's never gonna get any easier, but somehow you can make it through to the next day.